guys, I'm going to show you today how we manage as a family, our 2 plus 2 crew, that's Andrew, me, Sam, Oscar and Tabitha, how we manage to travel with only four cabin bags wherever we go. We bring our allowance of duty free, we all wear our ski jackets so it doesn't get really really heavy in our bags. We wear our ski boots, then we all take a backpack each. So in here we might have electrical gear, someone's got responsibility for that, and in there I might have the toiletries, and then the kids have their stuff. So I'll show you how we pack in four cabin bags because it really cuts the cost down. Right, so this first case here, is Oscars so what I do is you can't see here but I tie a colored ribbon to the handle so they know each one's theirs so in here obviously for skiing he's got beanies he's got his neck scarf and he's also got his salopettes which are essential and this is pretty much duplicated for Tabitha as well he takes responsibility for taking some of our GoPro stuff. So it goes in his bag because he also has his own action camera, lucky boy. And then we have what we call in our family monging trousers. So just a pair of uh, cotton trackies to wear around the hotel. Then lots of fluffy socks. Basically, it's the thin base layers for skiing. I've got merino ones because we have those from New Zealand. Luckily, we have a set for each of us. The top, long johns. So each of us have got this. In case it gets really cold, because we are in Norway, he's got his balaclava. He doesn't always use that because I find kids tend to run really hot. Ski socks, I pack for a week. Even though we're staying in Norway for two weeks, I always pack for a week and I might do one big wash halfway through. Fluffy socks and t-shirt, underwear, then more layers. So thin layers again, cotton layers in case he does feel that any of the merino gets itchy. Another thin layer, this time's uh, polyprop. So lots of thin layers and what's cool about them is they pack down really light then basically what else some charges normal socks in case he needs those and of course his goggles for skiing because they've each got their own of those because we're here over Christmas this year I've had to pack something extra so here he's got a nice shirt pull it out <laughs> nice shirt and nice jeans for Christmas day so normally I might not bother with that we're lucky enough that the swimming pool this hotel has a swimming pool He's got some swimming trunks. That's pretty much it. A few pairs of liner gloves. And I've just noticed something that Oscar snuck in when mummy wasn't looking. He's got his walkie talkies. <laughs> a couple of fleeces. And you can see there's quite a lot of gear in there. And that's inside one of uh, the cabin size it suitcase. And as you can see, you've just got a few fluffy socks left in there. And that's it. That all goes in. And that's the lot. And then what I do, I put the dirty clothes, go in the outside pocket. And when they're full, they get washed. So that is Oscar's suitcase. 